swear to Christ we finish this game tonight. I swear to God. I... We, we will be done with this game tonight. No more storm. No nothing. Now is the time. Okay. Yeah, so we're right back where we were. I'm assuming was yeah so right after we beat um, ultimate weapon which I'm <laughs> really glad we saved like a spastic uh, as we as we went through those phases of fighting it cuz goddamn again no thank you goodbye bye bye <laughs> bye oh, okay I guess we're fighting It's fine. It's fine. Cloud's over leveled. He doesn't need XP. It's cool. It's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna need to look at their materia again. Cause I don't think it pretty sure it didn't change.
That's not the one I meant. Okay. Got Bahamut Zero. Okay, so he's got all his. Oh no, we haven't gotten HP Absorb yet. That's what it was, okay. That's right, we get that in here, I think. Are you? Dead is what it is. Okay. Fine. Uh, yes, hello, Cloud. I would like to climb back up as you're supposed to be able to do with this. Oh, no, that's right. You go down here, and then you climb back up. Sick. Okay, good. Perfect. Perfect. Vincent is just getting his shit rocked in this entire dungeon. But their cover materia is pretty darn good. Cover's great, but it makes one character eat shit quite often. Yeah! That's what I'm noticing. Just fine. Uh, it just means I'll save Vincent's mana for uh, healing and uh, uh, summons, basically. That is true. I should probably take some of this off. We want Destruct on. Haven't used Gravity in forever. Was kind of using Comet a little bit. Yeah, we can take that all off, though. Like, honestly, he doesn't really need magic on when he's got enemy skill materia. Oh, 
course, super close to another level on counterattack. But we still want that destruct added effect because, because you know, because it's great to to have Vincent just counterattack, auto kill enemies. That's not what I meant to do. Oh. Okay. Does it have anything useful on it? Because the only reason I can think of that an enemy like this would be spawning is if... Oh, he doesn't have his steel... I don't know that it, a weak a weak enemy like that being there makes me think he's got like something. Um, take that off. Put steel back on. Oh, we'll give Vincent W item just in case like we have to use multiple of something. What is wall? Oh! It's M barrier and barrier! That's sick. That wall seems real fucking good. I don't think I've actually looked at what Remedy does. Um... Here's abnormal status. Oh, is that just a catch-all for, um... Seems like a catch-all for, uh, uh, status effects, basically. The fuck are you? Couldn't sense. Run? <laughs> what happens if I fight the Tonberry? Oh lord, he coming. What does a Tonberry do? Gonna get doinked? I mean, does it have anything good on it? Oh, no. Oh! I 
I don't know what just insta-gibbed Vincent, but, uh... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I stole from it, and then it became, like... I, d I don't know, actually. It's changed. Oh, that's fun. You can't go past the chest. Cool. Should, uh, take a peek at what a Tonberry does in 7 for me. Or if I get anything from one. Not that I highly doubt I'm gonna find another one, but... You know. Just for shiggles. Or if, if it has anything. Okay, we're back at where we were before. Let's split this into two. We gotta go into two groups. Let me pull up my handy little list here. What is this thing? That's pretty good, actually. Okay. Um, so Cloud, go... Cloud, go left. Barret, go... Right. Tifa, go... The right. Red 13, go... Uh, left. Uh, I believe Yuffie also go left. Yeah. And then Kate Sheath go... In battle, Tomberries advance toward the player party and when close... Use their signature chef's knife attack, which either does massive damage or instantly kills a party member. If attacked, they counter with karma, doing damage to the attacker based on how many enemies they have slain. Compounding their offensive strength is their high HP. Holy shit! So basically, never attack it as Cloud, is what I'm getting from that. Uh, yeah, Kate Sheath is... Uh, I believe we sent him right. And then Vincent go left. Yeah, Vincent go left. And then Sid also go left. Okay. Uh, 
Alright, everybody's got stuff they're gonna say. We went through this last night. Excuse me. Okay, yeah, we go left. Another fork in the road. Uh, Cloud is going to go... Cloud goes down. The one I encountered was the Master Tonberry. Oh boy. I'm guessing denoted by the, the little star over his head. Um, yeah, so Cloud go down. Red 13 go up. Yuffie go up. Vincent go down. And Sid go up. So it's just gonna be me and Vincent for for a sec. Steal elixirs from them, and they have a very low chance of dropping mega elixirs. Oh, Master Tonberry is an enemy in FF7 in the Northern Cave. Unlike the normal Tonberry, a star floats over its head and its skin is blue instead of green. It has 44,444 HP. Alludes to the pronunciation of the number 4 in Japanese and Chinese, which spells it sounds the same as death. Right. Um. Yeah. Fun. Ah! <laughs> He's back! Run! Oh lord, he coming! Oh lord, he coming! Okay, um, so I need to make sure I get all the chests in here. Because there are some very specific items that I would like. Oh! Hello! Goodbye! Oh, wait, I need that. Oh, thank God I can climb back up. Jesus. Ugh. Oh, he's coming back. <laughs> I think he's just chasing us. This time a Master Tonberry gets a turn, it walks two steps toward the party. It may randomly change its direction. Once a party member is within its knife's reach, it inflicts instant death. The Death Force spell and the Safety Bit accessory can render party members immune to it for the duration of the battle. Uh, resist also grants temporary immunity. Knife's attack dispels resist in instead of causing instant death. Interesting. Uh, magic counter. Oh, is that like you pair it with something and it... Um... Oh, that's pretty solid actually. Not quite what I need, though. 
Um. Okay, hang on. Between Master Tonbury's turns, the party, taken as a whole, may attack at once undeterred. Any additional attacks between Master Tonbury's turns is retaliated with an unstoppable counterattack called Everyone's Grudge, which deals damage equal to the number of kills the target character has amassed multiplied by 10. This attack inflicts fixed damage and cannot be blocked, but can be avoided by inflicting stop or paralysis stale status ailments on Master Tonbury. This is the most absolutely important part. Master Tonbury can be morphed into a ribbon, ribbon, one of the best and rarest accessories in the game. The player cannot use sense on it. Interesting. Just want to make sure I'm getting... Yeah, I knew it. Okay. Probably just not going to risk it on the Master Tonberry, though. Honestly. Jeez, I am kind of curious if there is another way. Huh! That's a big boy! That's a big boy! Behemoths are so cool. Probably my favorite Final Fantasy monster. Still up, I see. Oh, oh, you beat the shit out of Vincent. Hey, buddy, get up. Go get up, buddy. Don't block that! Oh, this boy just won't die. Don't put another Shadow Flare on him, Vincent. Jesus Christ. Vincent, you're so good. Man, that fight was not worth the resources used on it.
Where's, uh, oh, there they are. Okay, they did, they, okay. I, I just wanted to make sure that there wasn't like a secret other fork in the road kind of thing going on. Oh, hello. That's a fucking Gundam. Wait, why is he coming closer? Okay. Okay. How do you like one of these? He was pretty okay with it. Probably because he's like hiding. What is this thing? He also keeps turning back and forth whichever party member hits him. I don't like this. I don't like that he's coming closer. Okay. Sure, bud. F just fucking weird fight. Give. That's not what I want. Give me the real prize of this path. By using your morph material more often? Yeah, I probably should. Give me what I desire. Like on this guy. Hey. It's a don't kill him. Oh. It's a don't kill him. He's he's gonna kill him. Oh, maybe not. So you have to kill him with the morph command. Oh, now I'm sad. Why does this one suddenly have a jillion more health than the rest. Okay, Vincent. Drop one comet. Oh, I took comet away from him. That's right. Vincent, don't kill him. <laughs> Shit's dumb. Vincent, don't kill him. Vincent, don't kill him. Because I'm going to fucking kill him. 
This one's just really strong, I guess. Like, compared to the other ones we fought, this one's just ultra strong. Or something. Vincent, don't kill him. Mother f- <sighs> Give, 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 give. No, give. No, uh, give. Mm. Yeah! That's the good one. That's the good one. That's the one we want. Uh... Get this bullshit out of here. This is the one we want. Oh wait, attack all. Maybe we, okay, we keep it, and then we put this in, too. Now everything has the all. From what I read, one sec, I've got, uh... Got, uh, thingy. Gotta look at it real quick. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. Uh, let's get Cloud to stop being- No! Uh, let's make Cloud stop being sad. That one's called Alamein? Okay. Okay, we get- we got the one that I came here for, so... Any items we happen to miss is fine. I just wanted that mega all. Actually. Hang on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What, but what if? But what if? Uh, Alamein uses the powerful level 4 death and level 3 flares counterattacks if a player attacks it with magic. The player has a party level party of level 99 characters, the latter may spell certain death. Yeah. Uh, Alamein uses both once per battle. It mostly uses physical attacks and may use its claw attacks twice in one turn. Teardrop does minor non-elemental damage and always inflicts sadness, and Big Breath does non-elemental damage to one party member. Uh... Alamein has low HP and the party can kill it in a few turns. Yeah, right? Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. Hey, were you thinking of leaving me? No. I can't let you guys go by yourselves, you'll make me worry. Plus, who am I gonna have tea with? This is the center of the planet? Oh. Cloud, look! Yeah! Hey Cloud, I found this on the way! Yeah! Here, Cloud. Yeah! But I found this. Yeah. Hey, Cloud, I found this. Yeah. Let me down to the rest. Uh, what? By the way, Yuffie, didn't you find something on the way? Oh, all right. Here, Cloud. Ooh. But I'm the one who found it, so you better give it back to me when you're done with it. 
Mm. Being with you all isn't so bad. Okay. So, there's a couple things we gotta do here. Uh, we're gonna just, just dump that into him. And also that. Um... See, counter materia is just counter attack, yeah. Let's see. Attacks with paired command when damage is incurred. Oh. So like you could <laughs> you could put counter Bahamut Zero and just call it a day. Okay what that sounds like anyway um oh yeah we got equipment imperial guard oh wow it's i mean it's not terrible it's not great either it's just flat damage reduction instead of a percentage only works as long as you have Bahamut Zero summons available. Right, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I don't... I wish I knew how these stats affected, because, like, maybe flat de defense is better than percentage defense. I don't know. Um, okay, so Vincent could use a mistile. That lowers his defense quite a bit though. His defense percentage goes up, which I feel like is good. So we'll we'll give him that. Okay, so is this is this the route or is is when I go down... Here, let me get my mouse. When I go down here, is this Sephiroth? Should I... Should I, uh, uh... Drop my save crystal here? Down there is... Well, the path... Okay, but how long is the path? It's fine. It's fine. We'll drop our crystal. We've we've come quite a ways down. Oh shit, I have power source. Uh yeah, why not? Fuck it. I can't use it here. Oh god. Maybe I can use it here. Okay, I can use it here. Yes, I would like to create a save point here. Thank you. I'm halfway! Okay, well, fuck it. We dropped it. Yeah, we don't need that. We'll save. I'm assuming there will be, like, a, another save point or a chest with another save crystal or something. Uh, let's get going. Alright, everyone, let's mosey. Damn, again? Stop saying it like a wimp. Can't you say move out or something? Move out. What? Look at the number. Fuck, they're coming out in full force. Cloud, you go first. Okay, I'm going alone. Why oh, you got a bitch shame cloud like that? <laughs> Shut up, it won't do us no good with everyone back here. Barrett's right. You take two of us with you and go first. The rest will catch up with you later. Is this like a practice run before the final battle? Yeah, a major practice run. I'm fine with that. It's probably more fun than meeting Sephiroth down there. Oh, this might be fun to pass time. coming they're already on the floor next to us 
Cloud, hurry up and make up your mind! Well, I mean, it's pretty fucking obvious. You know, fucking... God. All of you, I don't like that noise. Yeah, later. Stop rushing me! Okay, let's cure Sid of his sadness. And heal him. My question is, should I equip my ultimate weapons now? Ugh! I don't like that! Sid doesn't have any materia on! F fucking... Destruct healed it? Or something? I was wondering why my materialist looked really full all of a sudden. Okay, Satan Slam. What? Satan Slam misses. Oh, shit. Satan Slam never miss. You implying Satan is a flawed <laughs> being? Uh, actually, Cloud should heal. Oh, yeah, Cloud should really heal. think of this hey we got it <laughs> life's greatest question what does that even do okay well we're off to a great start right okay okay well I mean, first things first. Yeah, it unequipped everything. Like, even his accessory. That's hilarious. Uh, okay, so Aurora Arm is probably the best he's gonna get. Um... You know what, we'll give him that. Okay, so first things first. Where's life? Okay, so we need time. We need time all, right? We need... We need, uh... Pandora's box is beefy. Pandora's box spell power is equal to 3.75 times the base magic damage and ignores the enemy's defenses. It can it can be reflected. Casting Pandora's box on Proud Claude at the battle square with a party member and the enemy both hefting reflect on can result in an infinite loop. Holy shit. That's amazing. Um Where is life? Oh, 
Oh, revive. There it is. Jesus Christ. Okay. Scared the shit out of me. Um... Now we want... Phoenix. And then we put... Leviathan. Um... You know what? Let's give him counter death blow, because why not? Why not? Just in case he gets hit, he can just... It's a free, like, poke. Uh, sense, and then steal. And that leaves... Oh wait, which... Do I have the right sense materia? Oh, okay, it doesn't matter, they're both... Yeah. Um... Maybe we just put this on him as well. Fine, I'll use a phoenix stone, I guess. Gosh. Okay. Oh, another one. I know you! I saw your movie. Oh yeah, I need to put on the... Oh, it didn't stop him. Oh, jeez. I don't like that one. I don't like that one. Yup, yup, yup. I remember you. Mm. Can we steal from him? That'd be kind of cool. Jesus. Oh, so we can. Oh, he's gonna kill us! I should set up barrier. What am I doing? Ow. Um Yeah, put put barrier on. Okay, that helps. Yeah, that helps significantly, Jesus. Ha! 
Ha <laughs> Got him! Okay. First things first. Bam. Bam. And death penalty. Okay. Not you again. Okay, well, clouds set us up a barrier. Something's wrong. <laughs> we got, we got. <laughs> it's a zombie dragon. Oh no. <laughs> we got big trouble right here in River City, boys. <laughs> Vincent's destruct materia full heals. Oh no! <laughs> well, then maybe we'll just cast life on it. Toss an X potion at it, yeah, could do that. I was just gonna have Vincent keep using Pandora's box, but I'll have I'll have it. Uh... Oh yeah, because it's a full heal, so it might be a full full die. Okay, don't need to worry about it. Next time. X Potion and Max can only do... Okay, yeah, yeah. Dragon? What? What's... What's dragon? Is that a limit? Oh, okay. X and drains HP and MP from an opponent. Oh, oh, that's why Hyper Jump healed him, because it dealt death. Because it did death to a zombie. Okay. But then when Vincent attacked it, it did recovery, so I'm assuming that's what the Destruct Materia was. Um, I kind of like that, though. Drains HP and, and MP from him. It's pretty good. Lordy. Where are we? What's this? Oh! Genova? It's coming! Oh! oh! It's like a minor version of, uh... Okay... Well, I mean, we know what to do, boys. We just dump everything on Genova.
I don't appreciate the gross Parasite Eve look. Glad FF8 and 9 worked out the issues with having weapons that and limits that deal death and stuff like that, plus the issue with end barriers use. Oh, they're already hasted. Okay. FF8 and 9, having a magic barrier does not negate the effects of healing spells on your own party members. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, Leviathan, you'll never not be absolutely tantalizing to my ears. Oh, that did pretty good. Leviathan good for you do daily bleeding through ear holes. Yeah, I guess. What? No countdown timer. Yeah, that's right. That's right. No countdown timer. No countdown timer for you, Genova. Get the fuck out of here. Fuck you. Just didn't have time. Go to your room. Oh, that's fucking weird. Light. A light. Is this... Is this light holy? Once upon a time, this game was meant to be on the Super Nintendo. That's wild. Ah, damn, man. Barret? What? So everyone's together again. Whoa. Whoa. Hey. Oh no. Sephiroth. Bleh. Oh, is this Sephiroth's power? My, my body. I can't control my body. Uh. Bleh. My front legs, my hind legs, my tail's about to rip off. This is definitely not good. He's way out of our league. I, I don't know if I can go on. Bleh. Cloud. Cloud. Oh, bleh. There. It's there. Cloud? Holy, holy is there. Holy materia is shining. Aerith's prayer is shining. Holy Aerith. It's not over yet. This isn't the end yet. I mean, we gotta take the boys. Always the boys. Oh! So it's given us like a hey, hey. Hey, get your full heal up, equip any other stuff you think you might need, 
because it's about to get fucking wild. I appreciate that. Um, better fill in those materia slots with what? I feel like... I feel like I should give Sid Ultima, because he doesn't really have any, like, offensive magic. Um... Yeah, I don't know what the fuck I would put in here. Attach Ultima to counter? Oh, you dirty. Oh yeah, because Death Blow is not useful here. Oh, pff, God, I don't... I can't really think of anything else that might, uh... be worth putting on. We got the Bahamuts, right? Got that. Got that. I mean, honestly, haven't been using this. And I mean, what's the likelihood Sephiroth's going to poison? Unless Isuna heals, like, status effects, right? Here's status effects, yeah. Okay, well I think that's all I think that's all she wrote, honestly. Never a situation where it isn't a relief to have that materia equipped. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, I think that's all she wrote. I wish it would let me save. <laughs> That'd be nice. Oh wait, I'm not ready yet. Oh, I see. To, like, give you the opportunity. Okay. Make sure everybody's material is still equipped. Okay, that's fine. That's good. Okay. Let's go. I wish... Yeah! This ain't nothing. Whoop! I can't be fooling around in this hellhole. I still have lots of stuff to do with my life. I was frozen in time, but now I feel as though my time is finally beginning. Sephiroth, now it's your time to sleep for the ages. God, he's so cool! Aerith's memories are memories. We came to tell you our memories. Come, planet, show us your answer. And Sephiroth, to the settling of everything. Ooh. Everything will totally be settled here. Oh! Think about the sequence of the five targets and beat them. What? What does that mean? Vincent, quick, use Pandora's box. Just blast everything. Pandora's box is the representation of what I got from that hint that it gave me. Okay, I did something. Head portion be dead. Okay. Don't do that. Oh! Why did that kill him? No! Casting regen and doing a thing that open involves opening the PS1's disc crate during attack and animation. Cause the game to freeze but not lock up or crash from it. You can just wait out your full regen. Oh, that's kind of cool. Too bad this isn't the PS1.
Hey, Sid, if you could stand up, buddy, that'd be great. Right magic D dead. Core C defense down. Left magic E dead. Core C defense down. I don't know what these mean. Don't do that. Means I can now harm his core, okay. Blech. Well, there's something going on there. What's with the two different models going down? I don't like that. You're like, that's a bug. Wait, now there's like three models. Oh no, it's an after image. Or not? I don't know what's going on anymore. Don't do that. Imagine the fucking design meeting for this. Hey, what should we have? What animation should we have for, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> what animation should we have for Pandora's box? Oh, you know, space and a big question mark. That makes sense. That makes sense. Big question mark. Like, the biggest question mark we can model and still fit on the disc. In fact, I want that question mark to take up 75% of the third disc. Please and thank you. The other 25% can be the final dungeon and bonus things. Love how the ground that got uprooted when Neo Bahamut pulled up Sephiroth there was just the black void he was suspended in. <laughs> yep. Big question. This is my favorite spell in the entire game because of the big question. Don't do that. Ah, fuck you. I'm just gonna beat the shit out of you now, if that's cool. Bet. Did portion be revived? No. Still have I don't know if we still have haste on. It looks like we do. I feel like I'm missing something. Like, it said pay attention to the sequence of the things, but like... What's the sequence? Uh... 
I am ever so slightly confused. Okay, head B is dead. So that's a bug then. It wasn't a... That was just two separate Sephiroth models that somehow got loaded in. And then the real one died. Interesting. Also, hell yeah, Bahamut got the final hit. Oh no! Oh no! don't want to use okay let's just see what happens what no you can't use that that's mine no that's mine I fucking killed him Okay, Bahamut. Okay, so I did like half damage. Uh, see, look, I could do that too. No problem. Don't kill Sid again, please. Sephiroth! I have a question for you! You know what, I'll try and debarrier him, and then we'll do Bahamut. Yeah. Then barrier eventually? Okay. do like a heal and then uh oh yeah what's what's that buddy what do you got going on there uh-huh Ah, oh, some math. I'm fucking dead, aren't I? Oh, 
Oh yeah? Okay, yep. Okay, gone. Right. Uh huh, that's, that's the asteroid belt. <laughs> Fuck Pluto. Uh, here goes Jupiter. Bye, see you later. By Mercury. So, see you, Venus. So, if he could do this shit the whole time, why the fuck did he summon Meteor? If he could just blow up the sun. Like. This seems like a better plan than Meteor. Motivation is to use the planet as a vessel for his mother to travel to the stars. He just blew it up. Ah! Oh no, Sid's confused. Oh no, Sid's confused. Oh fuck, oh fuck, ah oh, jeez. Don't do that. Oh haha, <laughs> fuck you. Supernova is a summon spell. Oh. Well, I think it's time I used my own summon spell, bitch. Bitch! Yeah, I got space magic too, Sephiroth! Bitch! Fucking blow up the solar system! I'll see about that! Bitch! Ya fucking dick! Bahamas mad! Bahamut angry! Bahamut blast! Sorry, D spell. D -s oh, took away our haste. I'm gonna need to ask you to leave. Say ya. Fucking just Izuna drop you from over here. Leviathan mad too. More Bahamut. What is Dean? Ah. Uh, Vincent, get another cure off, and then you can go. Fucking buck wild. Nah, you know what, Vincent? Just go buck wild. I would rather have my main damage dealer going buck wild than, uh. than standing around curing people. Cloud, Cloud can handle that. All he's doing is summoning Bahamuts right now.
Gotta go fast, boys. cool boss fight though I gotta say Think you could do it another time? Oh, Sid's Sid's fucking dead. He can do it as much as he wants. Oh no! Well, I'll just put the controller down for now because this is gonna take a sec. Cause he's gonna blast Pluto again. He gotta blast everything again. So, you know, we'll just let this play out. Maybe I'll check check my text messages here, you know. You know, just take a look here. Yes, very interesting. This is not good. <laughs> this is the worst that it could have been. At least... Oh, it didn't go off. Well, there goes Cloud. Yeah, this is not good. Wait, Sid's back. Hang on, hang on. We can fix this. We can fix this. Come on, Sid. Fix it. How did Cloud get silenced and confused? He's got a ribbon on. Gee, I don't know. Maybe... No, Vincent has the ribbon on. Not Cloud. Cloud doesn't have ribbon on. We put ribbon on Vincent, remember? Because... Because added effect destruct... And counter. It's fine. We got Cloud back. We'll we'll get a we'll get a cure three out. Everything will be fine. We'll get a cure three out. We'll put an M barrier up. It'll all be fine. Or it won't. Or it'll be the worst.
Hey, it's fine. We'll just we'll we'll pick Sid back up. We'll do another cure three. We'll get another M barrier out. At least since silence is cured. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. But I think that's a white dude. Unless Vincent can somehow pull it out, I think that's a wipe. And it's highly unlikely Vincent's gonna finish him because he's got wall up, so Vincent is only doing like half damage, if that. So white. I mean, I may as well, uh, like if I'm being honest here, may as well just quit and reload. I know what I need to do. Uh, it's it's one of those too many eggs in one basket situations. Um, because Sid has both life and Phoenix, and he should really only have one of those. And for the sake of damage, I'm probably going to shift the cure and all materials on Vincent over to Sid. Because once Vincent transforms, there's fuck all that he can do. Like, he's just gonna... he doesn't heal or anything like that. He's still up! Oh my god, what if he pulled it out here? What if this was it? Yeah, of course it wasn't. <laughs> Going to drop you to one health. God, I would... I would scream if that was... Wait... No, fucking no. <laughs> You're fucking kidding me. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Easy clap. Easy clap. <laughs> Fucking calculated from the start. Don't at me. Oh my god. That is the most magic pixel it has ever been. It cannot be more of a magic pixel than that. Holy shit. Fucking clip that. Show it to all your friends. I am the real... Final Fantasy 7 player. <laughs> Holy shit.
This is all we could do. Wait, what about Holy? What's going to happen to the planet? That, I don't know. Isn't the rest up to the planet? You're right. We've done all that we could do. All right, everyone. We did our best. That's it. Let's go home proud. What happened? I feel it. What? He's he is still here. Oh, still. Cloud? He's laughing. Wow! Cloud, 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 cloud. Hey, it's Kingdom Hearts. That's more accurate than you realize. <laughs> This is it, Sephiroth. You and me, sword to sword. The way it always should have been. <sighs> Omni Slash! my video game. What a neat little victory lap that is. Just like, hey, hey, look. Here he is. Here's Omni Slash. Just get him. Just fucking kill him. Fucking enjoy it. Just just push that button. Go crazy. Oh hey, I can finish watching FF7 A Bridge now. pull up with someone hanging off him. Yeah, fucking with his skinny ass arms. Cloud stonked. Oh, uh, we only had the budget to animate us. Oh, never mind. There they are. Ah, I see. No Yuffie or Vincent because it's not guaranteed you'd have them.
Cutscene isn't in game. It's yeah, it's pre-rendered. It would be nice if they had put two in, but I like. Who knows? I mean, granted, by today's standards, this cutscene itself probably doesn't take up too much, but I'm betting they were just having a rough time just fucking squeezing all of this into the third disc. Wow, that just says shit. That wasn't bleeped out or anything, that just said shit. Haha, <laughs> transformation number three, motherfucker! Oh, that's Marlene! <laughs> oh! Oh no! Oh, that's a lot of dead people! Oh, that's a lot of dead people! Unless they evacuated Midgar, which I highly doubt they did, that's a lot of dead people. Just like to note that the pilot of the Highwind, in order to save everyone in the Northern Cave, flew. The high wind directly into it. Hey, he's a full pilot. He was he saved up that limit break. And here he is. He came. He saved our asses. That's what you call a limit break. Yeah, I was gonna say, even if they're in the slums, that's a lot of fucking tornadoes. I mean, what am I gonna do, Omni slash Midgar? Or, or meteor. <laughs> My big question is, okay, we saved the planet from Meteor, how much of the planet is actually, like, left to... to live on? <laughs> because, like, Ultimate Weapon left a huge fucking crater in the ground when we beat that. Uh... Midgar's getting torn to shit. 
Although I suppose Midgar rebuilds semi-okay because of Advent Children, like... Bitch, I'm back. No motherfuckers forgot about me. Oh, okay. So we don't we we don't even see meteor get stopped. We just see live stream comes up. Aerith smiles. Credits. We, <laughs> we don't even see it get saved. We just have to assume. Interesting. I'm wondering if that's why they felt they needed to make Advent Children to be like, No, it's, 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 everything's fine. It all worked out. Also, here's three of Sephiroth's quote children. Yeah, thanks to Advent Children, we know for sure, yeah. Although I'm kind of curious how long after 7 Advent Children is, because Midgar is, like, basically rebuilt? Mostly, from what I remember? I'm gonna have to go watch Advent Children again. God damn it. F7 came out in 97, Advent Children came out in 2005. Right, yeah, what I'm saying is how long after uh, 7 does Advent Children take place? Because the only reference I know to it is Tifa says that battle we had all those years ago, and Marlene is, like, still a kid. Like, she's grown up a little bit, but she's still a kid. Remember, all the extra stuff like Crisis Core Advent Children and the FF7 remake were supposedly planned for the start. Hey, I believe it. I'd believe it. I feel like fucking Nomura had all of the Kingdom Hearts planned out from the start. In some way, shape, or form. I, I think Kojima had most of the Metal Gear Solid series planned out from the start right? Like, exact events and, and story beats probably changed over time, but, like, you know, these big, huge game series that have these crazy complex stories, I feel like that was all, like, planned, right? Most of it was planned, and then over the years, maybe you ch tweak some things here and there. Nomura had all of Kingdom Hearts planned out from the start. That man needs a lesson on not making shit convoluted. I mean, 
honestly, the only reason Kingdom Hearts is convoluted is because the games are... The story is presented to you in such a wild fashion. Like, insane. When you line up everything, like, in the timeline and stuff, like, Kingdom Hearts 3 has a the story so far thing that it plays through, and with everything lined up, it it isn't as complicated as, as uh, people used to think. Like, once you segment it out and line it up from start to finish, it's, uh... It's, it's, it's not, like, there's still some complex parts, but it's not very convoluted as a whole when you look at it from start to end. Look at all the people it took to make this game, yeah. Fucking wild. I don't think it's a lot compared to most games nowadays. Like, yeah, there were a lot of people on, on this, but... God, you look at some game credits nowadays and it's like, holy shit. I feel like this looks like a lot because it's like taking the time to list everybody out in very clear like this is this person this is this person whereas you know games nowadays do it like movies where they're like okay here's the cast here's the director here's the producer now here's the rest of them in just a big list that scrolls up the screen that you're not paying attention to whereas with this it's very specific like Hey, here's all the people. We're not putting them in a in a double bracketed or a, a double like side by side list, scrolling it across in very tiny text. Big excite. Yeah, we finished it. We we fucking did it, boys. I now have FF7 context. I guess I do. Five hundred years late. What? Not me. Epilogue scene likely, likely takes place after Advent Shitter. Well, yeah, I would assume 500 years later, like... But that's Red 13. Do I remember how Advent Children started? Fuck, I don't know. So Red 13 lives 500 years is what I'm getting from this. And he had babies. With... Okay, you can stop that. Oh, wow, it just closed. It just closed. It just closed. Didn't Advent Children start with kids laughing? 
You know what? Now I'm curious. Because Advent Children, uh, uh, Advent Children opening. Oh, here, I'll pull this. I'll, I'll make a little. I'll make a little. Uh, we'll make a little. We'll watch the opening real quick. Uh, uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Uh, display capture. Yes. Mmm, that compression. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> it's good. But why does it do that, though? Very confusing. Well, that's the end of that. Uh, I'm not sure what we're gonna do tomorrow. Um, might play more Halo with Duck. I'm not sure. Um, might do. I'm probably not going to start Xeno Gears until Monday because uh, Cody is going to be out of town and I want to get his reactions to the beginning of the game live because that shit's a fucking doozy. Um, see what we could like what's like a one-off that we could do on friday if we don't play halo um let's see i've got i got um I will figure something out. I won't. <laughs> I'm probably going to go ahead and end the stream now since we have more than made up for the time that uh, we lost yesterday with the storm taking everything I ever loved from me. <laughs> Death Road to Camp. I don't have that. I don't. Uh, do I? Uh, D, D, Death, no, I don't have that. Anyway, yeah, I'll figure something out. See ya.